Yo, what's good, everybody? We got another Beers with Barton. It is Monday, March 14th, 2022. I hope everyone's having a good start to the week. Uh, we just got back from our weekly um, joggers for loggers, where we go to uh, Mount Holly and uh, we run a 5K. We usually walk it. Um, and then we uh, get some food off a of food truck, have a couple loggers, and hang out with... Uh, our good friend. So I think we've done it now. This is our fifth or sixth time. I think we only missed one week. But anyways, that is not what today is about. Today is about officially having to return to the office. So for the first time in two, almost two years to the day, it was March, I think, 10th or 11th, um, 2020, when COVID first started and things started shutting down. So I took a job at Wells Fargo at the end of um, October, of 2021 and I uh, met my boss at the local Starbucks he gave me my computer I did everything set up online and everything obviously has been done you know through zoom or Skype or whatever which has been fine I mean the onboarding is uh you know the the training process and trying to learn sometimes it can be a little harder not being in person with somebody but you know you figure it out and you know I continue to learn every day the process but I've been talking about returning to the office in a hybrid uh Kind of set up three days there, two days home for a while. So about a month ago, they finally said, hey, it's March 14th. It's real. So I got a badge in the mail about two weeks ago. It's like a temporary one. It says contractor, but I think it's just, you know, for me to be able to get into the um, to the office. So today was the day or the week was the week. Uh, my boss was great. He said, you know, work whatever days you want. Um, so my plan is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Um, Jessica works uh, from home Tuesday, Wednesday, and then I'll be home Wednesday, Thursday when she's in the office, and then Monday, I'll just leave early um, around 2.30 to come home before Michaela. But today was just, hey, get a lay of the land, make sure the badge works, understand everything, kind of get a feel for it. So went in today, got there about nine. Um, big building, uh, huge building, says Wells Fargo. So I walk in, I see Wells Fargo. There's a two, you know, there's three floors, second floor. I'm like, cool. So I'm walking down this long hallway, get to a place, looks like it's a Wells Fargo entrance, follow some signs, go ahead and get in there, go to the second floor. I'm on the first, I'm gonna go to the second or third, walk up, it's a Wells Fargo. I look at the map and I say, I think I know where this is. It's open seating, it's like hoteling. So I go sit down, like get everything set up. It took me like 10 minutes to get set up, my displays, I'm like plugging in. It, it was like one of the monitors wasn't working. And I had to change the, the display options and it wasn't charging my laptop. So I messed around with it. Finally get set up, text my boss, hey, I'm here. I'm in this section. You know, let me know. And he responds right away, come to this section. So I'm on the wrong wrong section. So I go back out, unplug everything, go back out. And uh, I'm looking, I'm like, man, there's no, there's no section that has this name he gave me. I'm like, hold on. So I go back all the way out, go down the elevator, go back to the first floor, walk out back to the original hallway. And I'm like... Where am I? See another sign that says Wells Fargo Security Office. Keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. Finally, I see to my right a security desk. There's a couple of security officers. There's an actual gate, or the other one was just like a door. I had to use my badge. Try it, it works. Get in there and realize the floor that I am on now makes more sense. I'm not on the second floor. It's actually uh, one lower, one level below. Get on there, walk in, kind of see the section, walk in, I'm walking all around this place, still can't figure it out, I'm texting my boss, feeling like a dodo bird. Finally walk all the way back to where I first came in, in, the, in that area, not like all the way out. And as I'm walking out to go to this one kind of side pocket where it was where I was supposed to go, he comes walking out with a coworker because um, he said they were gonna get some coffee, they'd show me around. He kind of chuckled, said, hey, why didn't you figure this out? It's so easy, right? And he goes, I, I was even kind of turned around for a minute and I, I used to work there. So anyways, got a spot, went through my stuff down, went to go get coffee. Uh, the coffee shop was not open. The cafe was not open. There's nothing open in this building. There's like nobody there. So it's so weird. Anyways, uh, they, there's like a little break area. Luckily they had some coffee. So we did that. Kind of got a little bit of lay of the land. Um, I had a one, you know, I had my one-on-one on Monday. So like doing it in person was very weird, but also kind of cool. It was easier for sure. And I just asked the questions and like, you know, go in the system and update stuff as, as we were talking through it. So 
Definitely some pros and cons. Um, it was weird to wear pants again, like real work pants and a button up shirt and dress shoes and you know, drive. Luckily my commute's about 18 minutes. Um, and then once I park and walk, it's like five minutes to the building. So it's not horrible. Um, there's actually a parking garage in the back. Once I get a parking information, I can, uh, I'll park there and it's closer. So it was weird for sure. Um, so, and you know, I left around lunchtime today and came home. Um, yeah, it was definitely weird. Um, I guess I'll get used to it. Um, not sure I'll love it, but, um, you know, it is what it is. Um, so this is kind of back to some sort of normalcy and we'll figure it out. So I did return to office, but I did get to go to my joggers for loggers tonight, which was great. Um, had a couple beers, some good food trucks. Um, I had the gyro or the hero falafel. It's delicious. And then I grabbed some beers. I also went, um, uh, grabbed some beers at the grocery store as well today and, uh, picked up some more slur cane. The good old Sycamore Slurricane. Um, and also March Madness was this past weekend, but that's not what this is about. Uh, the Heels got an 8 seed, didn't love it, but uh, I'll do a March Madness one uh, probably tomorrow. And uh, we'll talk about that. So, hey, return to office, it happened. First time in two years, it's weird. I've already got my clothes laid out for tomorrow, and now I kind of feel like, uh, you know, I've got... I've got to get myself moving tomorrow. I can't just kind of bum around until like 8.58 and then, you know, walk into my office. I've got to kind of plan my day. So we'll see how it goes. We'll get used to it. I'm going to figure out workout routines. Am I going to work out early in the morning? Am I going to work out late in, in the afternoon? Um, are there going to be, you know, or, you know, some of the days going to be rest days and then I work on the weekends instead. I don't know. We'll figure it out to day by day. I, I really have no idea, but uh, it was definitely different. Um, but I've got a great boss, very supportive. Um, one of my coworkers, the first day actually, she has two daughters and uh, I think one of her daughters wasn't feeling good. So she's in the office for a couple hours and then she uh, she ended up having to leave to go pick up her daughter, like, you know, first day back. So it happens, man. Life is, uh, it's life. It's what, you know, it's what we have to do. So we'll get used to it people get used to it uh, we'll see as the days go on if people are really going to work three days if you see kind of those middle days maybe a little bit maybe the mondays and fridays will be quiet i, I never plan on being on a friday maybe i'll maybe i'll move to tuesday wednesday thursday at some point who knows what it's going to be I, I don't know um but anyway so cheers at least uh got to have the normalcy of um the joggers with loggers seeing good friends and uh at least started monday off somewhat okay and then we'll go from there. So cheers, return to office, it happened, it's real. Um, you know, Jessica has no sympathy for me because she's been back in the office for, man, a year and a half now, at least um, some part time. I think they went back one day a week, um, October of 2020 maybe. Um, I don't remember the exact dates, then it was two, then it was three, then it was four, and now it's three, I don't know. Anyways, it's, uh, it's definitely different. Um, I guess I'll get used to it. Um, I don't really necessarily see the value yet because all my calls are still on like Zoom or over the phone. I don't, you know, no one I work with is there. So, um, but you get the collaboration with your team, I guess. That's kind of the, the trade off. So, cheers to Monday. Um, returning to normalcy, whatever that means. I'll drink to that. Man, that's a good beer. Slur cane, seven percenter. Man, I'd love to be back in New Orleans right now. It was such a fun trip back in 2019 that we went. First time. All right, guys and gals. I hope it was a great Monday. Uh, definitely feels like a really long day because um, I got up and um, really had to start planning out my morning. So I'll, you know, I'll be making lunch tomorrow morning. I'm probably getting a workout in. You know, showering. And, all this stuff that I've never done, I haven't done in two years. I mean, I didn't make my lunch in the morning, obviously. I didn't work out in the morning. It's usually working out at lunch or late afternoon or like right at five o'clock. So, excuse me, that all does change. Um, so, I don't know. Apparently today Potter was looking for me, although, um, you know, he, he didn't really know where to go. So, uh, sorry, buddy. Well, he's going to have to get back to some normalcy too. They used to be in this crate all day, four or five days a week. All right, guys, that's it. Monday, back to the office tomorrow. At least they had coffee there. 
Until next time. Adeuces.